So the talk of the town here at NAB is the new Vericam LT, and I'm joined right now by Paul McNiff. Paul, good to see you, man. Good to see you. Paul is an expert at all things Vericam, so talk to us. What's new with LT? Well, the great thing about the LT is it's very similar in a lot of ways. Uh, infrastructurally, the inside of it, the sensor is the same as on the Vericam 35 cinema camera. Our Super 35 sensor has this dual native ISO, so we've got it 800 native. But then what you do is you turn that off. It's almost like having two sensors built into the same wafer. It's like you could turn off the 800 sensor and then turn on a 5000 sensor. So now your sensitivity is just through the roof, but your noise level is so low. You can now light something completely with practicals. Like if you go into our theater, we've got a thing that takes place at night in New York City and it's shot with no light. It's all using street lights and, it, and, and it's just magnificently beautiful. 14 stops, dynamic range. HDR is all of the rage at NAB. It gives you the latitude to pick and choose when you're doing your coloring, it just opens up a huge palette. We've got a tremendous color palette in both of these cameras as it is. The differences are gonna be obviously the size. With the LT, because of its size, you can fit it on a drone really easily. So we've got a Team 5 drone over here, uh, and we've also got it set up in different configurations with different kind of cinematic setups. It works great on gimbals because of its small size. Now on the LT, in 4K, you can go up to 60p in a 4-2-2 color space. In 2K, in a crop mode, you can go up to 240 frames. So if you're going to be over cranking and doing high speed stuff and you want to really get incredible slow motion, you've got a camera that you can really do that with. There's two different mount possibilities. So out of the box, it comes with an EF mount, and the EF is designed for still lenses. What's great is that the PL mount is just an accessory, and it can be swapped out by the end user. And it's very easy to just put it on. It takes like three minutes. And that's an advantage that really most of the other cameras that are out there don't have. So who is using this? What directors are using this? And what sort of great projects are they shooting using these capabilities? Michael Fitzmaurice shot a full-length feature on the Vericam 35. It's called Monolith. A lot of stuff done in the desert. I mean, he was really putting the camera through the rigmarole, doing it in 110 degree heat and so on. And it was great. If you remember the Bad Santa, the sequel was just shot. So full-length picture. The biggest name that we've got is that uh, Orange is the New Black for season four. They just switched over to shooting on the Vericam 35. Paul, it's been such a pleasure. Really, really cool stuff. Great capabilities. Yeah. People are gonna have a great time with Vericam LT this week. Thanks very much for coming by. Thanks, Paul.